So, I took the time here to circle the areas where raccoons might run free. I'm never going outside again. And then these are the subsets where the moss types could grow. But you factor in this delectable little beauty. This right here is where our victim was digging, give or take 40 yards. Well done, Bragg. Thank you, sir. I live to serve. Sean, this woman might make us obsolete. No, we've got absolutely nothing to worry about, Gus. Found it! What? Now, I am a little confused as to what would fit in the hole this spot. Oh, <laughs> Betsy. Betsy, this is where we come in. See, I'm sensing that this hole is ideal for a standard-sized pirate's chest. <laughs> Sean, that's ridiculous. The ground is damp. It's obvious that our guy was searching for and found the Fountain of Youth. <laughs> oh, Gus. You're clearly not accounting for the possibility of the lost city of Atlanta. Atlantis. Well, I've heard it both ways. And they're both wrong. One of them was yours. Uh, they're kidding, right? Unfortunately, no. Excuse me. Can we at least do a background check to see if there's a chance that our digger is 900 years old? That feels more reasonable. Dude, I am missing work. Get us in the game. Okay. There's two sets of prints here, all right? Now, our guy is a 10 and a half, but the other set is a 12. So that means, based on the weight imprint, that his partner is a six-footer, give or take. Well, Spencer, it was very nice knowing you, but I think we've got it from here. Sight, the final season, Wednesdays at 9 on USA. Characters welcome.